Hello, folks. Welcome back to Evil Joe's A List. Wow. Firox, you, uh, Firox, like, you, uh, really dug into the, uh, into the uh, Nightmare Film series. I mean, wow. Just, uh, just went all out with that shit. I mean, seriously. Okay, I get it. But after watching the films with you, along with Rex, we all realized one thing. I should put a very special character on the A list. So, in commemoration of the Nightmare on Elm Street series, today's A lister will be none other than the than the nightmare of our in our hearts, Frederick Krueger. Yes, Freddy Krueger is now on the A list. <laughs> What's that? You thought I should put Jason Voorhees on the A-list, too? Uh, no. Uh, yeah, he's not asshole. Yeah, technically, Jason's not technically asshole material in most of his movies, but I have to look over them again sooner or later. But, Freddy Krueger himself, the man of your nightmares, is now on the A-list. Uh, yes. Because of many, many reasons. He goes after kids. He's a child murderer. He is the bastard child of a thousand man a hundred maniacs. Yes, he's a he's a crazy psychopath. And even when he was murdered by the parents of Elm Street for killing twenty kids, what happened? He died and went to hell, but came back as a nightmare. Where of course he would break the rules of reality all the time, like an asshole. And as the film series progressed, he just never knew when to quit. Seriously, look at all the movies he's actually start. Oh, wait, the song got bad. <laughs> oh, boy. Hope I didn't get fit. Hope I don't get hatred on that one. Although, there is actually an a-hole in that film, too. I mean, seriously, every time Ferox watches a, every time Ferox Rikes watches a movie, Rex and I are there with him to commentate on it, like MST3K style. Which, now that I said that out loud, we should probably really release a video like that. I don't know why. Oh, well. <laughs> Anyways, <laughs> look at all the films Freddy has started. Yes, truly an asshole. Though, to be fair, he's an a he's a real douchebag in, like, part five with the whole coming back through, uh, the ch through a baby. Really fucking stupid. As for Freddy's dead? Yeah, he's an asshole in that one, too. Albeit very comedic, feel wise. New Nightmare? Actually, no, I'm not going to lie. I, I kind of like that one. Yeah, uh, seriously. I mean, Ferox also liked it too. Uh, Ferox Frank likes it too. Uh, even Rex kind of thought this one was okay. I mean, it is a precursor to, to Scream after all, which is a really good horror film and an homage to the slasher genre. I mean, I'm, I'm really not going to lie on that one. I mean, I should probably put like some of the killers on the Scream films on the A list as well sooner or later. Well, today, our A-lister is good old Kruger, because he deserves it, because in our hearts, we know he is a true nightmarish asshole. Oh, yes. <laughs> Thank you very much. Tune in next time, and we'll look at another movie A-lister, or a gaming A-lister. Or, albeit maybe somebody in a novelization or something. I mean, I haven't actually done novels lately. Well, now that I think about it, there's that, there's that John Cory book I was reading beforehand. I, I think I should actually uh, go back into that one. But either way, ladies and gentlemen, I hope you enjoy your day. And pleasant dreams. For sooner or later, we may, you may actually encounter the asshole known as Mr. Kruger. Actually, who the fuck am I kidding? After the uh, after the 2010 film, nobody gives a shit anymore. God damn, they really need to fix this franchise up. Anyway, catch y'all later.